So I'm Jan Devi Balala, just call me Sir Dave. So our topic for today is all about electric flat iron, domestic appliance. But before we discuss our topic, let us read our objectives. So now let us read our objectives. At the end of the lesson, the students are expected to identify the different parts of electric flat iron, give the function of each part of electric flat iron, and recognize the importance of electric flat iron. Class, who among you have an electric flat iron in your house? Did you know about the different parts and the function of electric flat iron? If not, let me, let me discuss all about the electric flat iron. So, what is an electric flat iron? So, flat irons are constructed with heating elements that become hot when the flat iron is plugged into an electrical source and the power switch on. Meaning to say, electric flat iron is a domestic appliance that used for pressing clothes and to remove wrinkles in our clothes. Okay class, he is the father of electric flat iron. So class, let read all the text. The electric iron was invented in 1880s when electricity became widely available in homes. The first electric iron was patented by Henry W. Seeley in 1882. So, so according to the text, Henry W. Seeley is an inventor of an electric flat iron. When the time approached so fast, the electric flat iron evolved. Now let's proceed for the next part of our discussion, the different parts of electric flat iron. So, now let us read all together, AC line cord, pilot lamp, Soil plate, body and case, selector switch, thermal fuse, heating element, thermostat, and the handle. So now, let's proceed. What is the definition of all different parts of electric flat iron? First is the AC line cord. So what is AC line cord? AC line cord is used to connect the unit to a power source. It is an example of AC line cord. So when the socket plug into the outlet the electric electricity will flow to the wire of the AC line cord up to the electric flat iron next is pilot lamp a pilot lamp is a light that illuminates under specific conditions most commonly when an electrical circuit is energized so meaning to say the pilot lamp indicate if the flat iron is functional or not as you can see, it is an example of a pilot lamp. Second one is sole plate. The sole plate or base of the iron is a flat, roughly triangular in shape. The modern metal of choice for sole plates is aluminum coated with a non-stick material. The sole plate, which is heated and applied to wrink, wrinkle clothing, allows a user to to concentrate on a small areas that need extra attention. So meaning to say, the sole plate is a flat surface and a triangular shape with a metal part of electric flat iron that used for pressing the clothes. So it is a sole plate of electric flat iron. And this one is an example of a sole plate of electric flat iron. The next one is the body or case. Body or case is used to protect the internal part of the flat iron and serve as shield for the heat and protection of the hand of the user. Meaning to say, body or case is the protection for the heat and it is to prevent the electrical shock when it is used. In this picture, show the body of a electric flat iron. It is the body of electric flat iron. So on a, in the actual, it is the body of an electric flat iron. Next is the selector switch. Selector switch is a type of switch used to select the amount of the heat required in ironing different types of fabrics. It can be a rotary or slide. So, meaning to say, switch is used to select 
or to control the amount of heat in the clothes. This feature is a rotary type selector switch. But in this actual, the selector switch of this electric flat iron is a sliding type. This one is the thermal fuse. Thermal fuse is a safety protective device used to cut off the circuit when the temperature rises at above normal as designed for the unit. So, meaning to say, the thermal fuse is the part of electric flat iron that give protection to avoid overheat. But other electric flat iron does not have a thermal fuse. Heating element. Heating element is a form of nichrome wire that assembles properly inside the high temperature metallic tube in the flat iron to provide heat. So meaning to say, heating element is the part of electric flat iron that supply heat to the salt plate of electric flat iron. So it is an example of heating element. And this one is the actual heating element of electric flat iron. This one is the thermostat. Thermostat is an important component of electric iron that regulates its temperature. So meaning to say, thermostat is a part of electric flat iron that used to maintain the heat for the clothes. It is an example of a thermostat of electric flat iron. So this is an example of actual thermostat of electric flat iron. The last one is the handle. The handle which allows a user to handle the iron without being burned. Also holds the controls for the temp thermostat and the steam release. So meaning to say, handle is used to hold the electric flat iron for pressing clothes and to avoid burn to your hand. So it is an example of actual handle of electric flat iron. Okay class, that's all for today. Thank you for listening.